All right. At any rate, we got ourselves some plot over here, so I'm gonna go ahead and just get, uh, just bury my face in this lore. Oh, you came back to keep me company? Okay, then. Humor me with a little hypothetical. Imagine that a few hours from now, you climb to the top of that tower. There's a flash of light, then magic happens. Then you find yourself in the real world, living whatever you take to be a normal life there. What would you do then? Uh, whatever gets my rocks off. You know, I think that right there was the very last time your transient beliefs are going to take me by surprise. Let's clear this up once and for all. Suppose you get out there with all the human beings. What you're going to do is rinse them for all they've got without a care for a soul? Um, precisely. And you would treat everyone with this sort of contempt. Or would there be some people you kept for friends? Friends are just another instrument. A flute. Because, you know what they say, blow on all your friends. I applaud your willingness to accept difficult conclusions, but I do think you must be at least some breed of sociopath. You'd best hope that if you ever reach this real world of yours, it's run by people with more principles. Else you may find yourself just another instrument in someone else's orchestra. Sexy. Still, your ideas strike a chord with me. Why bog ourselves down with moral dogmas when you and I could redesign this place in our own image? I will give this some serious consideration. Be seeing you. Family.html For those of you who have faithfully followed this blog for the last five years, I just wanted to give you one final update. I'm going to spend my remaining time with my family. Yeah, I know, I know. There are probably 50 plus posts about all the problems I've had with them, but in the end, they are my family. They are the people I grew up with, the people I care about, the people I love. Sure, they annoy the hell out of me. They've said awful things to me and put up so many fences. But that doesn't change who we are. In fact, if we didn't care about each other, this stuff wouldn't upset us. Do I still believe they were wrong? <laughs> Hell yeah. Would I behave differently if I thought we all still had a lot of time? Definitely. But we don't. So I'd rather spend a couple of weeks sitting on the porch with my parents and my sisters than being angry and alone. Besides, it's not like we're going to fight about my job prospects anymore. If you can, try to make peace with those you love. It's your last chance. Thanks for reading. Lastdays.eml from Alan Jamison Institute for Applied Noematics to Fran. <laughs> you know what the oddest thing is about all this? We're not con we're not constantly fighting, having nervous breakdowns, screaming at each other. We're actually really polite and focused. And we spend most of our time debating the nature of humanity and how we can best succeed at probably the most ambitious thing anyone's ever tried. Like it was completely normal. Like that's just how people are. I feel like we've turned into Star Trek characters or something. I guess, what's the point of doing anything else? Getting angry isn't going to help. But I didn't expect you to feel like this at all. You know what? It's awesome. Many greetings and good luck. Alan. Psst. Love from George. Alright. We're done here. Goodbye, world. On to level three. On to level three. And it goes a beat one, and then a beat two. And then we got level three over here. Whoosh. Before the age of chaos, there were other what gods. Was this Warhammer all of a sudden? Gods. But for all their power, they could not save their world. Thus, I was made. And I shall preserve this world forever for you and your generations. That is my purpose. He kind of reminds me of God. Like, I don't, so there's this book out there called The Bible. You might have heard of it. Um, it's kind of popular. Anyway, there's this character in it from like the first like third of the book, the first half of the book or something like that. He's got a real God complex. I think that's what they named the book, like the, the concept of God after. Um, anyway, Elohim seems a lot like that guy. And, uh, you know, they're both, they both kind of got like a real ego tripping thing going on over here. Ooh, Cog! Sometimes I worry that the answers I embrace are too simple. Can we ever truly fully understand the divide between I remember this bridge from Dark Souls. Intellect? How much is nature? How much is nurture? If my intellectual capabilities and my knowledge were replicated in a machine, would that machine be me? 
Would it be human? And Aww. Well, uh, I guess, <laughs> guess that little bit of lore is lost to the sands of time. <laughs> um. All right, let's go ahead and cross over into the castle. So this level is called Big Stairs, Little Stairs. And what you do in this level is okay. You get that thing, and to do that, you gotta you gotta you gotta shoot a red laser right in that laser hole. Oh boy, I'm so excited! I can't wait to laser the shit out of yet another big red red receptacle. Um. Where the hell's the lasery stuff? Okay, so we have ourselves the ah, oh, we have the ah, oh, we have a fan, but I can't. I, wait, can I do something with this? Oh, well, tell you what, I can do is I can take the fan off the ground, chink, and then we can put it over here, and we can pick up the cube, and then we can. Take the cube and we can put it right there. We can take the fan and we can put it right there. I can then jump on the fan to get up here. And then that gives us another... That. Which turns that fan on. And if that fan is on... Can I pick up the cube? Well, I can make the cube fly in the air. But that doesn't really seem all that useful. Um... I can put that cube there. I can come over here and I can just put this fan there. I can then jump up on top of this. And I think that I'm supposed to probably put a connecty on top of the cube and then make it connect into that. And then that will give me the height to open up that, which will then get me access to another cube. All right, so we can do another fan over there. Can I open up this to find a connecty, maybe? No. I can... Well, okay. Let's just keep dropping shit around until I find my connecty. Oh, we have another cube. Okay, so that should be accessible with just this cube. So let's get over here. We're going to make the little stairs, the aforementioned little stairs, by just coming up over here, and then cube! And then now that I've done that, we can weigh down another thing. But I still know not where the connecties lie. Where, oh where, is our connecty in all of this? It's not hiding in this area. I can plonk there. I can then get a cube here. And if I had more well, I can hold the I can hold the button open with this fan and then I can put a cube there and then if I had another cube if I had a third cube I'd be able to make a stair up there and then I'd be able to get that um, and I do have access to one it's just I need to do oh there's the connecty okay cool let's go ahead and make that happen all we need to do is we need to put a cube there and then we need to put a cube on top of this fan. And then we need to jump from this onto there. Well, okay. We jump up there, then we place the cube down. Then I can grab the connecty. Then I can zap and I can... Oh, that's still not going to be high enough. Or rather, the issue is that the, uh, let's see. Okay, so if I'm up here, I can 
just barely see that little thing. Um, and that is indeed what she said. Uh, which is very unfortunate for everybody. However, I think I have another idea, which is I can come over here, I can jump up there, I can jump up there. We have blue laser up there, and then blue laser up there. Or, blue laser happy times over there. So, all I need to do is just find some way of connecting those two. Which I can do pretty easily. Watch this. Just come over here. Get that. Get that. Put that there. Put that there. That's now going straight up into the sky. Oh, we have a wall in the way? Hell no, we don't. Now that's all open. Come over here. Grab the other cube. Didn't think it was possible, and yet here it is. Now that we've done that, we can put a hell, put our do the same things. Almost the exact same things we were doing beforehand. Get that connector. Get that receptor. Get ready to solve some puzzle. All we do is we just put a cube. Um, well, we get a fan. I guess I'll use the one from over here. That's probably pretty reasonable. And we may actually want to do it from over here. Because I think that this one goes a lot higher. Uh, yeah, so that's probably what's going to end up happening in all this in the end. So, let's get a... Let's get the fan from there. We're going to put the fan over here. We're going to put a cube over there. We're going to take this connector. We're going to chain it up to that one. And that one. Put that there just to have it ready for the future. And come on through here. And I can jump up. And I can place a box there. That sends that... Okay, so there's not... Yeah, alright. That's a shame. But, I can disrupt uh, all of my hard work by just jumping into it, so that's fine. Now I can come up over here, we can get that connector, we can then get that thing ready. And I guess I may want to just move this over a little ways. Okay, yeah, this looks kind of promising. Damn it. Okay, so I think I kinda had the right idea. I just need to do the right idea, but better. -er. And I think that I can just accomplish that by... Okay, let's just try again. Alright, so I set that up there, and then I jump over here, and then I put that down. Yeah, it's just not able to get over that wall, so I guess what I can do, potentially, is maybe I stack... Um, is there a way to double cube? Let's try. So I put a cube there, I put a cube there. I come over here, I take this cube off temporarily, we put it over here. I get onto the connector, I jump up over here, I put the connector up there, now we're talking. That is one tall boy. Holy crap. And I forgot to actually solve the puzzle with the connector. So let's go ahead and solve the puzzle with the connector. And eh, eh. All right, not gonna fly. Let's grab the cube and let's put it back down. There we go, there we go. Put that there. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, we got our we got the the big man holding the rock now. So all I need to do is a step on this cube. That's opened up, and as soon as I step off of this thing, it's all gonna fall. All right, so I need some way of weighing this down now, and I think that all I need to do is probably just take. Oh. Uh, well, I know what I can do. I have an extra... I have an extra... Do I have an extra fan somewhere? I don't. So... I come up over here. I now have that. And then... If I jump up, I can't grab 
that or that, so we're kind of screwed. So I can hold down the button to make this open, but then I can't actually jump over to collect my prize. So, we're going to want to try and get that last cube from up there. And, you know, that's not going to be too bad, I think. <clears throat> I don't really have anything um, to base that theory of me thinking it won't be too bad on. But I can always just believe it. And, I mean, confidence is key, right? If you have any problem in your life, you don't need intelligence, determination, wit, charm money. You just need good old-fashioned bravado and being really, really cocksure. See? Worked out great. So with the last cube, I can then get on over here. Put a cube there. All my cubes are stacked up over here like they're having some sort of weird conference without me. Just because I don't have six sides well, they don't have six sides either. Wait, do they? Yes, they do. Okay. Um, I majored in uh, mathematics, not geometry, so you'll have to forgive me there. Let's come over here. Let's get the connecty. We will get that all set up. And I screwed up because I gotta put a cube down first. There we go. Now we do the puzzle solving. Oh boy, here we go. Are you excited? should be. If you're not excited, then, like, I don't really know what I can do to, to help you get to that next level. Please give me constructive feedback, and then we can work things out from there. Okay, so now that we've done that, we can probably just keep on stacking this guy. Look at that. Look at how tall, proud... Um, Kate Moss like energy is being channeled by that connector right now. I don't think it's quite tall enough to be able to get uh, onto the red receptor. I could be wrong, but I've never been wrong about anything before, so I find it a little hard to believe. Mm. Let's see, I can take this cube and I can put it there. Oh, wow. Yeah, there is. There is nothing that could ever stop that connector now. So let's go ahead and take that fan out of the equation. Boom. Plonk it all down. Got ourselves that red. And that red. And we wait with bated breath. We wait with... Ah, I screwed it up. Alright. Here we go. We put the fan down. We put box down. We put a connector. We connect. Then we connect. And then I messed up already. Because I'm not, I'm still not tall enough. I'm close. Very close. But all I need to do is take that box, put it there. Take that box, put it there. Take that box, put it there. Take the connector, jump, jump. We are now tall enough. And then I still can't quite do it. Okay, so let's go ahead and put the box there. Put the box there. Put the box there. Am I tall enough? The answer is still no. Um, weirdly enough. So, what we do is we take the fan out of the equation for now. We are going to come over here. We're going to put the box there. We're going to grab this box. We're going to come over here. We're going to jump up. We're going to take that box just temporarily, just, just off the cube. Don't worry. Chill out for two seconds. It's going to go back on there. Um, we don't need you to just panic just immediately. I know what I'm doing. So that we can set up the lasers. We're going to put that connecty there. Come back. Just get back up there. Get back up there. See? You just had to trust in me the whole time. Now we're talking. Everything's going fine. Cube one, two... Three, run over here. Look at that. Puzzle piece. Victory. Jump off. Perfect. Let's get out of here.
Goodbye, sweet puzzle. You were hella sweet.